Welcome to Gadgets Everything, a podcast ranging in subjects from sex to astrophysics. This time I'll take up something smack in the middle, my favorite subject of free will. If you read books about free will, the philosophy behind it, articles on whether you have a choice or not, or watch videos on this, you will find that this subject can be quite complex. There are the different angles and takes on whether you can have a free choice, whether you have free will, but let's leave all those complexities aside and make this really, really simple. Because you either have the possibility of free choice or you do not. You either possess the potential for free will or you do not. Either there exists some situations, some potential situation, where you could potentially freely choose. Or no such situation can exist. Now, if no such situation can exist, then everything you do is not caused by you. It is either caused by predetermination in a chain of events, this is called determinism, or it is to some degree randomly caused but it's not caused by you. Then everything is governed by the laws of physics. Now, if there exist situations where you can freely choose, then that free will part of you is not governed by physical laws or any strict law. Your free will must be totally yours in order to be free. So in that case, Whenever you choose something freely, that choice must be unaffected by past, present, or future conditions. Or it must be potentially unaffected by past, present, or future conditions. Obviously, you do not have only free will, but if there is a sliver of a chance of it, it is ungoverned by anything but you. It is governed by you. So, if it is not governed by physical laws, if it is in fact governed by you, the choice you make, then that part of you, that free will part of you, it is outside of physics. It is outside of space. It is outside of energy or matter. It is outside of time. And then it follows that the free will was never created nor will it ever die. Now ponder that and read the one-page book called Free Will and the article on Will. Thank you very much.